hi guys if your iPhone keeps turning off and on and keeps restarting then here's the fix the main issue may be due to the battery or it may be due to an incomplete update you may have tried to update your iPhone but the update is not happening so let's move to the first method the first thing to check is that if this is happening try to charge the phone to a sufficient level like 30 or 40 percent and see if your phone is not stuck in a low power cycle if this happens again try to force restart the iPhone how to do that just press the volume up button once down button once and then keep pressed the side button right side button okay do not leave the right side button okay until unless you see the apple iphone logo once you see the apple iphone logo appearing in the center of the screen just leave the right side button and you have forcefully restarted your iphone and now see whether your issue gets resolved or not okay if uh, the issue is not yet resolved then what you can do you can try removing the sim card okay and see whether due to the sim card this op uh, thing is happening if it's not due to the sim card just go to the settings scroll down and find battery tap on battery tap on battery health and charging and make sure the maximum capacity is not below 60 or 70 okay if the maximum capacity is below 70 that means your battery may be faulty and you may consider changing the battery from the ip Apple iPhone service center now let's move to the last method now what you have to do you have to just go to the settings okay and now once you go to the settings home page go to the general tap on general tap on iPhone storage tap on it and now here you will have to find the one on the page your iOS if it is an incomplete update and you get an option to delete that particular update just delete that update now once you have deleted the update again go to settings and general and software update and try to update your phone to the latest version maybe due to this failed incomplete update this problem is happening over and over now if this also does not work then what you can do you can try resetting all settings so just go to settings scroll down and find general tap on general and scroll down scroll down and find transfer reset iPhone tap on it tap on reset and finally tap on reset all settings enter your passcode if it prompts you to enter your passcode and then tap on reset all settings and then see whether your issue gets resolved or not thanks for watching please do like